Hi guys, Ed here and you're on my channel, Blood, Fire and the Pillars of Smoke. Today I'm going to show you a very simple recipe for sweet, hot and sticky wings. I absolutely love it, it's really easy and you're gonna love it as well. I've got here nice wings, this is about a kilo and a half. They are like already in a V shape. I really like them in this specific shape because it's easier to turn unless I'm skewering them. For that, refer to the video and it's gonna be right here. What we have here is, this is about um, six tablespoons of tomato ketchup. This, we're talking about uh, sweet chili sauce, eight tablespoons. One tablespoon, sorry, one teaspoon of uh, sweet paprika. Then we have here one teaspoon of ground chipotle powder. You could substitute for cayenne pepper, that's for heat. Two teaspoons of um, garlic powder. One teaspoon Dijon mustard. One teaspoon apple cider vinegar. Two, tablespoon, two teaspoons of um, Worcestershire sauce. And eventually, what we have here is one and a half tablespoon of Mediterranean date syrup. I really like it. Now you don't have it. If you don't have it, don't worry about it. You can substitute it with honey or with molasses. Your choice. So now we basically start mixing it all together. So sweet chili sauce in. Mustard in. Vinegar in. Worcestershire sauce in. Eventually, date syrup in. It gives color and a very nice taste. And the driest ones, so garlic powder, chipotle powder, and paprika. So now all we're doing is nicely combining it together. Right, let's give it a little taste and see how we did. Beautiful. All that's left is to actually marinate the wings. I'm going to show you how it's done with a little trick. We're gonna marinate these wings in a very interesting way. I like to do it with a Ziploc bag, okay? Why Ziploc bag? <coughs> it helps me to not make too uh, much dirty dishes. So all I'm doing is I'm putting this like that in a bowl. Then I'm simply throwing the wings in. Like that. Now we're almost done, okay? Next thing, pour the marinade over. Very simple like this, have a look. Now, pull it up. Start closing, try to squeeze as much air as you can out of the bag, like this and then completely close it, all right? And now, see this, I'm simply lifting it up and massaging it in my hand like this. Yeah, it's a double seam Z-Plock. I'm not too afraid it's gonna go out, but here you go. This is the wings in the marinade, all right? It's distributed nice and nice and even. In this way, it goes into the fridge for about two, three hours. You can do six if you want, no need for more. I'll see you then. The wings have been marinated. Honestly, only about two hours. Uh, that's pretty good, all right? Let's open the wing, the grill. Ooh. 
absolutely nice. So now we're going to start putting the wings on the grill. Now, what I like to do is I put it on the skin side like this. We will not use the marinade after this because it, it's a raw chicken and you don't really want to get any kind of bacteria. So this is just perfect. The residues of the marinade, which are not going in the grill, you just discard them together with a bag. Last one. So, I'm going to grill those wings about five minutes on each side, direct, medium heat, lid closed, and I'm gonna flip them twice, each, each five minutes. So five minutes done, flip, five minutes done, flip, five minutes done, another flip, and then after five minutes, it's ready to be taken off. I'll see you then. 20 minutes by, about 20, 20, 22. Let's see how we've done. You can see I've kind of grouped them a little bit so they grill more evenly, but let's take them off. Just take this on the plate, have a look. They look absolutely great. These caramel marks, this is where the sugars in the ketchup and the date syrup caramelized. And they will give us a beautiful taste. Here we go. All right, guys, here we, go. here we are. These are my sweet, hot and sticky wings. As you can see, really easy to do, very tasty. I will see you next time.